welcome back to my channel. Like always, I'm How To Tech Tips, and I hope you enjoy my videos. And of course, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share any of my videos. If you guys have any requests, please comment in the comment section below, or you can even email me. My email is in the description below. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install any Microsoft Visual C++ redistributable that you need for your computer. Normally you'll get like an error popping up saying that you're missing uh, Microsoft you know, Visual C++ 2012 or 2013. I will just show you guys a quick, I'll just Google it for you guys. Just so then you guys have an idea. Um, Microsoft uh, Visual C++ See if there's an image that will come up. Here we go. Um, yeah, so yeah, so you'll get like an image like this. In order to run the program, you're gonna need to get Microsoft Visual C 2015 runtime. Okay. So while we got that out of the way. And today is going to be this video, and it's going to show you 2012, 2013, 2015, and so on. 2019, I think there is as well. So, we're going to go back to the internet browser, and we're going to go to the URL, which is at the very top where you type in the website. I already have the website copied, so I'm just going to hit paste. Don't worry, I will put this in the description below. And I'm gonna hit enter. And from here, this is the actual Microsoft website. And you can see Visual Studio 2010, 2012, 2013, 2015, etc. So here it is, 15, 17, and 19, 13, 2012, 2010, 08, etc. Okay, so let's just say we want to download 2013. Then we would click the link here. And then it'll bring us to a new tab. And then we would just scroll down and find our language. Language. So mind English, United States. And then I would save it, make sure that it's set to a .exe, save that. Don't worry, your thing didn't do something funky, go yellow and red. I already have it installed on my computer, so I'll actually, I'll just uninstall it, show you guys real quick. might take a couple minutes go for a bathroom break go get something to drink go on your phone do whatever I'm currently on my phone so waiting for it to finish patiently also while you guys have a second don't forget to subscribe to my channel this helps me grow my channel and also lets me post more videos that could be helpful for you guys 
Okay, so set up successful. Okay, we're going to X that. And then we'll go, we'll download it again. It's fine. Yellow, red. Don't worry about that. And then we're going to open it. And then this is what you'll get when you first open it. And then you will agree to the terms. You can read it on your own time, doesn't matter. And then you would hit install. Again, might take a few minutes. Just because it doesn't look like it's working doesn't mean that it's not. Just doing some stuff in the background. Should be patient. Patience is key. And there you go. Set up successful. We can close this. And we can close the browser as well. And then go to the search here beside the start and we can go add or remove programs and we can look for it today's the 12th and there it is got downloaded which is perfect and let's just say that I didn't have this in here don't panic it most it most likely did install perfectly you just might have to reset your computer it's happened to me maybe once or twice where it didn't show up in the apps and features section. But once I reset it, it came up perfectly. It came up right where it's supposed to. And yeah, that's basically it. Thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to keep teching on.